Chief Minister Chairs Direct Benefit Transfer Payments Review Meet takes stock of progress for installation of POS machines at all state fair price shops. And CBI submits ballistic report from Ahmedabad Forensic Lab in Davolkar Pansare and Kalbulgi murder cases to Bombay High Court. Hello and welcome to Metro Scan from Mumbai. I'm Shama Mishra. Let's see the news in detail. Chief Minister Devendra Farnavis today chaired a meeting to review direct benefit transfer payments through Aadhaar linked accounts for benefits to actual beneficiaries. Farnavis also reviewed the progress for installation of POS machines at all 51,000 fair price shops by March 2017 and making its stocks transactions online. At the meet, officials informed that they are trying to make at least 50% districts kerosene-free within the next few months, which was announced earlier by Chief Minister. State Ministers Raj, Vinod Taude, Rajkumar Badole, Ravindra Chavan, Chief Secretary Swadhin Shatriya and officials from various departments were present at this meeting. The CBI today submitted ballistic report from Ahmedabad Forensic Lab in Dhabulkar, Pansare and Kalburgi murder cases to Bombay High Court in sealed cover. The agency also informed the court that Scotland Yard has refused to help in forensic probe in Dhabulkar, Pansare murder cases as there was no agreement between India and the UK. Meanwhile, the High Court said that it is not happy with the probe in these cases. A bench of justices said that it was very unhappy over the tardy progress in these murder probes. While Dabolkar was murdered in Pune on August 20, 2013, Pansari was shot on Feb 16, 2015 in Kolhapur. He died on February 20 that year. Professor Kalburgi was murdered on August 30, 2015. With the aim to reach out to voters, create awareness and bring in transparency, Maharashtra Governor C. Vidya Sagar Rao launched various initiatives to state of the State Election Commission yesterday in Mumbai. The initiatives included the mascot, newsletter and a mobile app, COP. The app will enable the citizens to reach out to the SEC instantly and report any violation of the Model Code of Conduct by any party candidate. While speaking on the occasion, Governor appreciated the spirit of voters from rural area and compared to urban cities and said the voter turnout in municipal corporation election in urban areas is relatively low, which is a matter of concern, and more focus should be put towards it. He further said that post-demonetization, the misuse of money in the elections will be stopped. India's leading experts on digitization and economy yesterday in a panel discussion on future of black money agreed that India had the opportunity to be the first country to implement a completely digital financial framework by adopting Bharat coin. Bharat coin, a digital currency on the lines of Bitcoin, is to redefine the legal tender in the wake of unexpected demonetization. Speaking at the occasion, Ajit Ranade, Chief Economist, Aditya Birla Group, said that black money is not static and people must first correctly define and understand black money. He asserted that policymakers would also need to tackle tax evasion and widen the tax net. The Chief Economist stressed that India's tax to GDP ratio is among the lowest and it is important to rationalize and widen the tax base by using technology. Meanwhile, Vijay Kalantri, President AIAI, stated that big reforms such as demonetization needed meticulous planning and as it, the success lies in effective implementation, India had a wonderful opportunity to move to a next level. This year, budget railway commuters can expect an inclusive plan from the Union Budget 2017. What more are the commuters expecting? Let's listen in. बजट इस बार यूनियन बजट के साथ मर्ज किया गया है ये पहली बार है कि जो दोनों बजट है वो एक ही दिन होंगे आइए जानते हैं लोगों से कि उनकी क्या उम्मीदें हैं इस बार के यूनियन बजट से जिसमें रेल बजट एक पार्ट होगा हमारे साथ कुछ स्टूडेंट्स हैं उनसे कोशिश करते बात करने की क्या एक्सपेक्ट कर रहे हो इस बार के रेलवे रेलवे के पार्ट से जी अभी अच्छा एक्सपेक्ट कर रहे हैं कि बाद में अभी और सस्ते से होगा और बाद में भीड़ कम होगा जी बस यही और ज्यादा परेशानी ना हो रेलवे को 
आसानी से सफर किया जा सके लेडीज को लेके फैसिलिटीज है उसके ऊपर थोड़ा और मतलब ध्यान देना चाहिए जैसे कि रात के टाइम पे मोस्टली लेडीज लेट नाइट ट्रैवल करती है तो एक पुलिस तो होना ही चाहिए इट इज अपॉन आस फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल दैट वी आर सेल्फ शुड मेंटेन क्लीनलीनेस एंड देन इवन रेलवे शुड लुक आफ्टर द क्लीनलीनेस ऑफ दिस रेलवे स्पेशली ड्यूरिंग वही बजट में हम हमको जो पब्लिक आम पब्लिक को अपेक्षा है भीड़ बहुत रहती है लेडीज डब्बा बढ़ाना चाहिए आई थिंक हमारे हिसाब से ट्रेन में भीड़ कम होनी चाहिए जैसे कि आप जानते हैं बड़े और छोटे बच्चों को बहुत दिक्कत होती है इन सब को मतलब थोड़ी सीट अवेलेबल रहनी चाहिए ट्रेन में क्राउड का प्रॉब्लम है वो काफी हद तक लोगों के लिए एक मेजर प्रॉब्लम है और इसको लोग टैकल करना चाहते हैं साथ ही जो मर्जर हुआ है रेलवे और यूनियन बजट का वो एक बहुत अच्छा मूव है यानी कि आप इस बार हमारे लिए एक इंटीग्रेटेड ट्रांसपोर्टेशन प्लान आ सकेगा साथ ही हम ये भी डिसाइड कर पाएंगे कि हमारे लिए कौन से जगहों पर पैसा डालना ज्यादा जरूरी है और साथ ही जो हम मोनो रेल्स की बात करते हैं मेट्रो रेल की बात करते हैं वो भी सरकार हमारे लिए ज्यादा अच्छी तरीके से उसका पूरा प्लान आउट कर पाएगी तो हम उम्मीद कर रहे हैं कि इस बार का जो बजट है वो रेलवे के कम्यूटर्स के लिए अच्छा बनकर आए कैमरा पर्सन गौरव काबरा के साथ श्यामा मिश्रा डी न्यूज मुंबई वी स्पीक टू पीपल फ्रॉम their expectations from the upcoming budget 2017 let's listen in hello ma ji ye ye jo online payment hum log lete hai as a shop owner ya customer pay karta hai to points aur change ka issue kam ho jata hai aur uske upar hum log ko pay karna padta hai taxes aur service charges we have to pay usko kuch try kare ki wo kam kare क्योंकि कस्टमर से हम लोग एक्स्ट्रा नहीं ले सकते हम लोग के मार्जिन में से वो एक्स्ट्रा जा रहा है ये रिक्वेस्ट रहेगी कि उसमें कुछ कंसेशन हो गरीब लोग को थोड़ा फायदा होना मिलता है ऐसा करो तो बहुत अच्छा रहेगा कम हो तो बहुत अच्छा रहेगा थोड़ा सेविंग में जरा फायदा हो सकता है So I am specifically looking at three things on the budget. So one is obviously uh, a good increase in taxes, and I am expecting that tax bracket will change. And then secondly, uh, a better clarity on uh, GST. So where we are at this point of time, you know, where will it, when will it get implemented? And thirdly, on the railway fares, probably. Uh, I am not sure. So this time, railway and the union budget are being combined. So let's see if there are some interesting price fare revisions in the railway prices. The budget we expect the direct direct taxation to go down and the common man. Expectation from the budget. We feel rationalised and in income tax. Retrograde form of tax. Government is saying there will be no future retrograde form of tax. But what is that should be done away with because there is no place for retrograde form of tax. Corporate and individual income tax should reduce. Then. If there is a reduction in the income tax, definitely there will be no generation of black money. Government should also come out with some system on funding of uh, election, so that let's have a white paper on that and discuss some paper, so that in future there is a generation of black money in politics and in all. That's it then in this edition of Metro Scan from Mumbai. We'll be back tomorrow evening, rather on Monday evening, with more updates from the commercial capital. It's over to Delhi Studios to Rukma. Thank you for watching. Namaskar. Thank you very much Shama with that we wind up this edition of Metro Scan thanks for watching namaskar